Uh, hello everyone and welcome to our next interview with Jant from CC Angels. My name is Lynn from Run It Back and we're just going to ask a few questions to try to get to know you and the team better. My first question is where did the name CC Angels come from? Um, okay, it's actually like the best kept secret, so oh. I cannot talk about it. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. It, no hints with the couch or anything. Just yeah, we will, we will, we will just let uh, uh, people to uh, think what they want. You know, we'll just run the imagination wild. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. We'll we'll keep it a secret then. Uh, well, I wanted to know about you in particular. I know you've kind of expressed on social media that you've had difficulties finding a team to compete with and work with. So could you talk about your your struggles with that and um, how you were able to find a team? Uh, sure. Well, uh, yeah, I had the struggles like find some team that I will fit with. Uh, I got some trials and everything, but didn't work out at the end uh, from their side or even my side. And yeah, I just I just was trying to find a team that will be fun to play with. And uh, as you know, I'm a mom, so I don't have like the whole day to play, you know, and stuff like that. So that's an aspect as well. Yeah, it was it was really hard, but I really want to compete, so I will always be trying to uh, find some good team and trying to prove myself. <laughs> right, so many responsibilities to try to keep up with, and I can't imagine how busy it must be to trial with teams as well. So, how did you end up finding this group of ladies? Oh, it was actually really lucky because uh, one of the girls just wrote me like a few days before the tournament if I am interested to joining them. So yeah, I'm really glad for that opportunity and it uh, it ended up pretty well. It did. It worked really well. You all had an amazing run at the qualifiers. So, so when you find a new team, could you explain what do you focus on to try to develop your strats and uh, have that team chemistry as quickly as possible for the qualifiers. Okay, so with this uh, team, we actually had no practice at all. The wow. first first match what we played ever together was the first match of the tournament. Wow, that is so impressive. That may <laughs> That makes me want to know even more, like how what what was going on that first map? Is so that's the map you took off of CLG? Yeah, I think so. If I remember well, it was the it was the first map against CLG. Yeah, uh, I I don't know what to say. Like we was not expecting that at all. Like of course they are so good team, and we was all surprised that the map finished like thirteen one. If I remember well. <laughs> yeah. What's well. something? What's something like? I was like, okay, this this I'm printing and putting in a frame on a wall, you know. <laughs> but yeah, we knew like they are super good team, and usually mm -hmm. teams like this have very good mentality, so we expect them to come back strong. And what happened? They beat us on the next uh, two maps. So yeah, but uh, it was really unexpected, and it felt really good. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Yeah, I can't even imagine. Could you share anything you remember during that map, like the the comms? What were they like, or just the overall ex experience of of winning that first map with the new team? Okay, so our comms are or was like really crazy. We, as I said, we are like completely mixed teams, so we had nothing prepared. We just was running how we felt it. And yeah, our comps are actually, uh, I don't know if I have any, I mean, actually I was streaming, so you you can find like how our comps was and it was, we are just a little bit, I will say, I don't know, special. <laughs> like our comps was just really crazy, funny, and uh, it, it sounded sometimes like you are in a zoo or something, so. <laughs> well, it got the job done, it seems. So. Uh, wow. I, I, another map I was 
curious about was your last map. So you were trying to make it into the next stage of the qualifiers against nothing to lose. Um, so you managed to take a map off of them, but that last map, unfortunately, you weren't able to do so. So could you share also what things were like during that last map on Haven? Well, it was a really long day for all of us and especially for me because my daughter woke me up very early morning. So I was pretty tired that day, but even showed. Um, yeah, I got really disappointed by my performance, but sometimes it will just happen. So mm -hmm. I don't know. I will, I will say we was just tired or comms was not that good anymore as it should be. And as I said before, we are a completely mixed team, so we have like nothing prepared at all. And sometimes it's really hard to play against a team who have months of uh, practice and are basically now, I think they signed, so now they are like professional yeah. team. But by the way, congratulations for that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Just right before recording this, the news came out, so definitely really happy for them. Uh, so do you all, have you all spoken since then? Do you have any plans to compete again? What What is that like? I mean, this team was uh, going in with, we are just going for this tournament because some of us have not so much time to practice and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, there is a possibility we might play another tournament like this but not anytime soon and it's it's not like we will be uh, practicing or anything as a real team so i think we just uh, we had really fun and uh yeah i i think maybe in the future if no one of us will find like a, a stable team we might to come back and talk about it that if we want to play another tournament then we will but it, it's nothing like we will be staying as a, as a team right now. Okay, so nothing concrete, I see. Well, I definitely hope to see you all again. It was definitely very entertaining for me, at least, to, to watch you all upset some teams throughout this tournament. And hearing that you all hadn't <laughs> played together it just makes it even that much more exciting to hear. So hopefully you all can compete in the future. Thank you. I hope so. I really hope so. Like, as, as I said before, I had really struggled to find a team and I'm so glad for this opportunity because in, in the last months, I kind of lost to having fun in, in, in the game, especially in trend games. But like this tournament, I had so much fun that it just, yeah, I, I cannot even like describe it. It was, it was incredible. I had really so much fun with these girls. That, that's amazing to hear. I, I'm, I'm so happy to hear that. Anything else you want to say? Any plug? Anything you want to tell your team or anyone else? I just want to thank uh, all of the girls I was playing with because, yeah, as I said, I'm, I'm incredibly happy this happened and we had so much fun and they are so amazing players and uh, persons as well. So. Just big thanks to the girls and, of course, everyone who making this tournament possible. It's always it's always so nice to being able to play in a tournament like that. Right. Well, thank you for your time and sharing your story and your team story as well. And thank you all for watching. This was Run It Back. Please stay tuned for future interviews on other Game Changers teams. Thank you as well.